If you use public transportation, you may have to dig deeper into your wallet. SunTran has plans to reinstate transportation fees at the start of the new year. But students at the University of Arizona are fighting to keep the transit fare free. News for Tucson's Megan Spector is live at the U of A with more. Good morning, Megan. Good morning, Destiny. U of A students make up 80% of the Sunlink riders. So when they found out that the free fares were ending this year, they came together to create their Why I Ride campaign. Now, these students have been attending city council meetings, talking to members one on one, and meeting with university staff to figure out how to keep these fares free. Student body president Patrick Robles says this is important because it affects so many students. He says there are a handful of benefits to keeping transit fares free, but one of the biggest benefits is simply reducing the cost of living for students across campus. Robles points out that a student parking pass at the university can range from $700 to $800. And with a parking pass, books, materials, and other necessities, he says it can add up quickly. We're already paying $12,000 plus if you're an in-state student for tuition. If you're out of state, you're paying more than $20,000 in tuition. Let's ease the amount of fees and the amount of costs that we have in students' lives. And let's keep public transit fare free. SunTran told News 4 Tucson they've been gathering feedback from riders and non-riders over the past couple of months, and they're turning towards the mayor and council to provide guidance on the future of the fares. Now, this is all set to be discussed at the city council meeting today, so make sure to stay with News 4 Tucson for updates on this. Live from the U of A, Megan Spector, News 4 Tucson.